As I've spent time praying and reflecting as we approach this Advent season, I have found in my relationship with Mary just the ways in which she really came to embody what Christ is now through the Nativity. So through this time where she's pregnant and she's expected to give birth to you know, the Son of Man, she's being rejected left and right. She can't find a stable place to be able to give birth. She's leaving her home. There's nothing but uncertainty during this time. And what's really moved my heart recently has been that Jesus was born into that uncertainty. He was born into discomfort. He was born in a smelly place. And I don't think that happened by chance. I believe that God asks all of us to spend this season praying and reflecting on what are the places in our hearts? What are the places in our lives where we're doubtful, we're uncertain, uh, perhaps we feel sinful? And how can I allow Jesus to be born into that space? Because that's exactly what Mary did. She gave us a foundation that seemingly felt like nothing and has become the home and the graces of this whole nativity season, this whole season of Jesus' birth. So I think there's a lot to learn from Mary in being able to trust God in the midst of what we think we've said yes to, and then God shows us that I need you to say yes to something that's challenging and difficult and hard, and how joy can be born in that, how there's a reason always to rejoice, and that there's always a way to make our heart into a Bethlehem. There's no such thing as giving a yes and a no to God. He asks for either the yes, and if you don't say yes, you're saying no. There's, there's no in-between. And Mary surrendered and gave all of it. And I think during this Advent season, it's a time for us to do the same. Leave it all in God's hands. It's a chance to start anew. It's a chance for us to deepen our relationship with God, to draw closer to Jesus, and especially to see how Mary can help guide us in all of that. Hello, my name is Sister Bella, and I'm a daughter of Charity of St. Vincent de Paul, and I'm coming to you from the Miraculous Metal Shrine here in Germantown, Philadelphia. And if you enjoyed this video and you feel inclined, please go ahead and donate to our mission here. Have a great Advent. God bless. Bye-bye.